Hey guys, British Open here. Today we're doing the Haplopus SP Columbia care sheet, also known as the pumpkin patch. Start off with, we've got this small little cup here, which you keep him in until he gets about, I'd say about one to two centimeters, in which he'll be moved up. Right inside, you can, if you can see that, you can see him for substrate. One centimetre of equal earth or cocoa fibre will do fine for this guy. As they do like to borrow a little bit sometimes. And you know it just adds a little, nice little touch for them. And maintains humidity rather well. Over in the back I've just got a bit of cork bark. Which also maintains humidity. Good for climbing and hiding as well. Next we'll move on to feeding. Feeding for these guys is pretty simple. But a lot of people do struggle because of their size when they're slings. So in the corner, if you can just see where that cork bark is, I've got a cricket leg, which I tore off. You can feed these guys them, but sometimes they don't like them because obviously they're not moving and they don't want to attack it. So you can go for fruit flies, which is what I'm going to be feeding them when I get some in a couple of days. Next, we move on to a bit that I call is a spider right for you. Now, as they're babies, they're fairly easy to keep. You know, maybe a little bit harder than some of the others. But, you know, the reward is well worth it as, you know, their colours when they get all those are really beautiful. Unlike some of the other ones. Now, these guys, they live for about six years, which is an okay lifespan for a tarantula. The size isn't that big, so you don't, don't have to spend lots of money on big enclosures like T-Blondies, which are getting like really big, and you have to have, you know, 10, 20 gun tanks for them. You know, they'll eat once a week, which will be fine. There's only really one setback for these guys, and that's, they're extremely fast. Not so much on their babies, but after they get to about, I'd say, 3 to 4 centimeters, they start to get some speed on them and you know if you're not careful they will bolt now the most commonly asked question can you handle them? you can handle these guys I mean I don't recommend obviously handling a little guy like this as you'll probably kill him but after they get to about you know two three centimeters you can pick him up if you want you can see he's playing the game there acting all slow but if he really did want to he could run Another thing about these guys is their venom isn't that bad, so if you do get bit by them, you know it's all good. Uh, they are docile, so getting bit by them is quite rare, which is what a lot of people do look for in a tarantula. So that's it really, hope you enjoyed, this has been the Hapalopus SP Columbia care sheet, thank you, bye bye.